doing the clay pot heaters for the deer stand. It's got jumbo tea candles in it. These are like pint size and these are like, uh, or those are uh, quart size and these are pint size. Been in there for about three minutes and they're still getting good oxygen. We're going to see how hot they get and how long those candles last. Alright, it's been 50 minutes. Candles are still lit. And that's pretty warm. The heat coming out is pretty deep. Yeah, that little bastard there is real hot. It's still lit. It's got some nice heat on it too. Especially coming out that little hole. Yeah, that sucker's hot. You see that little ring on how much of the candles burnt away. It's been uh, pretty much an hour. I'm estimating maybe four hours out of a candle. And after that goes down, that sucker is still going to emanate some heat. And this is the uh, two pint clay jars that got real, real hot. There we are, two hours. Candles are still going and these dudes are hot, hot, hot. It may have a lot to do with it being on the cold ground. I can see this sucker putting off some heat in a gear stand, but as far as a room in a house, I'm not quite so sure. But I think Pint size ones would be the ideal way to go. These dudes get hot. Whereas this big one don't. Well, it does, but not the hot you're looking for. Well, I don't know. Hold it long enough, it gets there. A little over three hours. Suckers are still lit in there. They're still hot. It's pretty cold out here right now. And we are at four hours.
temperature is getting colder out here. That guy's still pretty hot. And it looks like the candles might be getting down to the last bit. So I reckon I'm guesstimating about 30 minutes to an hour they're going to be done in. Almost at five hours. And that little thing is about down to nothing. Still hot. Still got a nice heat coming out of that hole. That was real hot. Five and a half hours. This one over here is done. Went out. It's dead. It's cold too. It's been out for a while. This guy's still hot. Five and a half hours of heat.